Namaste, my beautiful friends. It is a fantastic, beautiful day today. I hope all is well with you because all is well with this being. Feeling much more in my power and in balance and harmony with all that is today. Today was the first class in person of our health and fitness class. And it's the first time being in person with the whole group of students. And it was a process. It was, it was beautiful. It was a lot. It's beautiful. It's a learning and growing experience for this being because this being hasn't been in a classroom setting with that many energies since being aware, since having awareness of all these energies around this being and being able to feel theirs. And every time other people talk, being like just so in tune with everything that's going on instead of before in my past, it was a completely different dynamic. And the teacher, Dustin, is amazing. That really opened up the beginning of the class, feeling comfortable because of how playful and fun and open 111 he was. So that was beautiful. And it was just such a beautiful beginning to this journey that this being is going on. And it was just so exciting. It felt so good to be in school with my friends and with everyone and just learning and growing and to be in that space, that container for learning and growth. And we talked about all things that really have grounded this being even more. Talking about like setting goals, a vision board, spending, and our homework is every day to have an hour of meaningful activity and just finding what motivates you and what you want to bring your energy into and all these goals and everything. And um, he really showed us the big picture, which in the moment was a little overwhelming, but now I've spent like an hour or so rewriting all the notes and just processing all of the things that this being would like to do for this journey and it really 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 helped seeing the whole picture of everything and now knowing for these two weeks what all this being shall work on and just in general like it's funny we got a time management sheet and I got that sheet in rehab like two years ago and I was like I'm not doing that And now this being sees how important it is. And a nutrition log, that is so important because in the past few days, weeks, whatever, this being, Caden, has struggled with eating habits. And today's been completely different. And I believe moving forward, even after this course is over, having a nutrition log will be so beneficial because it kind of keeps you accountable and brings your awareness to what you are feeding this body. It's very important. And also the time management, just what are you doing so I don't, not so I have a set schedule and that I'm like, well, I have to do this and I have to do that. Like I still can flow with it. I can still continue to, it can change. It doesn't have to be set, but having those, those set things can be beneficial so that I don't get, that Caden does not get lost because a lot of times it's like, well, what do I do? What do I do now? Like, oh, I did that. Now what do I do? And just having these structures are going to make things, they'll have structure so that you have something to follow. But at the same time, it'll allow the flow of the routine to come much strongly through. So it's really beautiful to see that. And it's just really exciting and getting me excited, getting this being excited for the future. Because the past week or whatever, I was kind of... Caden was all over the place, like emotionally eating and just not knowing what the future held, what should focus on energy towards, kind of just stuck in the loop of distracting and numbing and not facing things. And this class today really brought forth the energy that is that is grounding in to this change, to this new space, to this environment, to this pathway that is unfolding of growth and evolution and higher vibrational states and higher levels of consciousness. And it's really important to continue bringing that forth at this time. (laughs) Crazy. Centered. And it's just really exciting to see all of that because 
that's what the intentions were coming here is being all healthy doing the thing and then coming here you meet people you get you find all these people you fall back into old behaviors and it's just not blaming other people all the people i've met are have been amazingly supportive and heart connection you know what i'm saying but it the dynamic allows the old autopilot behaviors of the being to come out because that was easy and that's comfortable and then realizing that and having to change it and then having emotions come up and having to not numb them to feel them it's just so much growth has happened this past month past month that it become it kind of came unshaky and then this new class beginning just like brought all of the energy that's kind of been scattered. You know you need to do all these things, but it's kind of been just scattered. And this class has really truly brought it all together and is focusing on the forward movement, the forward growth, the steps that are now needing to be taken to set up a structure. Really foundation and structure is so important because moving forward yes the unknown is where we grow and it's beautiful and everything but creating a structure to hold and to carry us into the unknown makes it so that we are always grounded entering the unknown like i have no idea what this year holds for me but if i spend every day if i create a structure for every day then no matter what life throws at you, you have your structure to hold you. It's like my favorite quote, rock bottom became my solid foundation. So coming here, I have this foundation. I know what I will deal with and what I want, what I will, you know, like I know what is good and what is not for me. Doesn't mean we can't fall back, but it, you have this foundation. And then as you have this foundation, you begin to build the structure. And building this structure, it's going, to, it is strong, it is firm. Nothing will knock it off balance. And I'm not saying you'll never fall off balance, you may, but the structure is firm enough that it is still there. Even if, so when you fall out of balance, that makes the connection, the structure is there, the structure doesn't fall, it is you that moves away from the structure and may fall. The structure is always there, it is your choice whether you use the structure or not. So this class is really important because it is bringing that structure into being built. And that structure is firm and strong. Like the time management, what you do every day, I wake up, I'm going to go on a run, I'm going to stretch, I'm going to do yoga, I'm going to do my TM, I'm going to nourish my body, then I'm going to go to class. Just having that, and it doesn't have to be that every day if you're, you, you tune into your body and feel what your body needs that morning when you wake up. But having that instead of just waking up and be like, uh, maybe I'll get up. You know, it's just, it's having that accountability, but only for yourself. You're not doing it for anyone else. You're doing it for your health and your benefit. And it's just, it's such beautiful structure. And like I said, like you have structure, the structure doesn't fall. It is you that chooses to come out of balance. Whether it's just like a choice you make, it, you leave the structure and you fall out. The structure does not fall. The structure is firm and it remains. Mm. And it's just beautiful, man. It's so beautiful to see how much growth is taking place and how much the future holds for abundant, infinite possibilities of growth and evolution. And I'm so proud of this being for how far we have come and how much more we feel in tune with who we are and able to express that. The ability to express our truth is the most important part of our experience in these bodies, in this physical reality on earth. The most important thing is the ability to express our truth, to stand our ground and to express our truth. And it's so beautiful to see that this being is feeling more and more comfortable with that. And just connecting all these dots and putting everything together and seeing how it all fits to form one puzzle, you know, all these pieces from millions of experiences that we have in life come together to create one beautiful big picture, picture of life, of existence. I'm so grateful. <sighs> I'm so grateful. 
I send you peace, love, abundance. One, one, one. We are all one. Stay grateful and stay blessed, my friends. Namaste. Thank <laughs> you.